YouTube, and hello to all my new subscribers. Today, as you can see, we're just going to do a short video, and this is going to be an unboxing of the Bias Mini guitar amp. And I'll kind of explain a little bit about it, and that'll be pretty much it. So, let's, uh, let's get into it. And the case that it came in is really nice. Well, sorry. As you can see. So, here we go. Alright. When you open it up, you are greeted with the little user manual right here and a card so you can activate which that's just a AR code that tells you about getting it uh, how to get it installed and stuff like that pretty much you just connect it to your computer when you're signed into your tone cloud account it comes with a uh, free download for bias amp 2 and right here we'll get into the power cable and connections first these are the MIDI connections for a pad like a pedal switch stuff like that it's a uh, pretty cool 3.5 millimeter uh, jack here are the power adapters for European and I'm not exactly sure where that is from but yeah and this is the power cable just your standard you know amp cable and right here is the USB cable which is um you connect it to your computer with that's the same thing as like what a printer would be using and that's out the way now we will get into the good stuff the actual amp it's really not that heavy surprisingly right here we have the bias amp mini and we'll, we'll, we'll go over the front panel first this is for your presets you can hit it twice and it'll go from the red to green channel and you can use the knob to select this is the gain bass middle treble master and here is the uh, output volume and you can see it is really designed well it's that it does not feel cheap here we go and the back panel excuse me that's for the power this is for your send and return with your effects loop. This is for the foot switch that you can purchase separately. That's where you plug it into your computer. This is the line out. And what I've heard, the line out on this device is awesome. It's got a built-in IR, which you can turn on or off in the software. This is a ground lift, so if you have a bad signal somewhere, you can... Uh, Swap that if you got some ground issues. And this is the speaker out, which is uh, 4 to 16 ohms. You can plug this amp into any cab as long as it's rated 4, 8, or 16 ohms. It does not matter the watts of the cab, the bias amp. What it does is it rates the output to whatever the cab is. So that's something really useful to know. You can use this with a uh, 8 inch speaker, just a 112, anything, it will work with anything. The technology that's used in here is awesome, but it does say do not connect with effects units, DI boxes, powered speakers, or any other grounded devices. So there are some limitations, but as far as cab goes, you can plug this into any cab, which is one of the reasons why I was so interested in getting it because that takes a lot of guesswork out of using a guitar cab so I think that's pretty much it I'll be doing another video on this unit going over the tones that I was able to achieve and thank you for watching